Today, I would like to talk about vandalism. Vandalism is defined as the deliberate or malicious destruction, harm or refreshment of any public or private property without the owner permission. Smasher, mailbox, gravity gear cars, busted window and other related crime are more than simply an show. It's your property crime like vandalism cause school, homeowners, companies, young people and other stakeholders billion of dollars. According to our statistics, because they are open to everyone and don't have a lot of restriction in public space, and facilities are the one of the vandalism the most. Where are the record for stronger guidelines and regulation with more serious penalty? This will deter vandal and give them the chance to reconsider their horrible action. Glass breakage has emerged as the more prevalent kind of vandalism in our community. According to our study and interview, every day case of glass breaking are brought to court all of the world. It's usually done to get access to the victim so that the crime can be committed whether in the burglary, assault or other type of crime. Among the causes of vandalism, the first is parents are the drivers of vandalism among teenagers. For example, when driving parents throw trash or peel of fruit such as rambutan and lime while ignoring speed limit sign. In addition, the lack of perfect control of and guidance from parents is also one of the main factors driving teenagers to get stuck in this negative symptom. Number two is the mass media has a very strong influence and effect and it is very difficult to avoid this day. The example of negative scene or from movie or show from the West that have element of behavior toward vandalism can influence teenagers to commit vandalism. Teenagers usually easily limited and follow what they see around them. The influence of film made by Westerner is one of the causes current generation children being affected with the attitude and behavior act out by them due of the of to a lack due to a lack of parental supervision to control the children knowledge during their growth parent and the community should set a good example for their children because while they are growing they have a strong desire to try a new thing and their understanding of what is good and bad is still limited. As a result, we must take we must take it seriously and prevent, prevent family members from becoming involved in the culture or crime of vandalism in the era of the new generation. So that the country and society are free of things that harm and destroy God's creation and the beauty of the universe. Thank you. Effect of vandalism. There are many effects that can be seen both physically and emotionally. The effect of vandalism are not only felt by individuals, but the surrounding community and the country also have a several impact due to immoral acts that cause inconvenience to all parties. Vandalism can affect individuals, communities and countries. Vandalism is often taken off granted by the local community. They just kept silent while the vandalism happened in front of their eyes. In the end, the community also languished as a result of the cultural activity. People find it difficult to communicate during an emergency. For example, a public telephone is broken while the house is on fire. In addition, the community is uncomfortable when using other public property. For example, getting wet while waiting for the bus because the roof at the bus stop is damaged because it cannot stop the rain. Scratches on the walls of public toilets aggravate and encourage the younger generation to imitate this unhealthy symptom. There are many phenomena of vandalism that can affect the eyes and this of cause affect the image of the country. The amount of loss due to this art 
of vandalism is very less. Vandalism, a location used to replay new one and repair damage facilities, would be better if them we used to emplacement. For the more benefit project to them, maybe petty gravity on the wall is cool the eyes. But do this now that this kind of thing only stain the wall. Arts like this only cost the government money because they had to spend thousands of dollars to fit. This is the art of people who practice. They do not care about the feeling of order. Society is only selfish. We need the use public faculty. We not need the destroy the them. The of vandalism in Malaysia. Among the initiatives that can be done, by the Malaysian government to overcome and prevent the problem of vandalism symptom in our country is the first we must threaten the authority and carry out the implementation of the law which is under the local government act nine vandalism by laws 1991 which this anyone found damaging public property can be fined 2,000 ringgit or jail for not more than a year. If convicted of any offense of vandalism. In addition, parents also have a very important role to prevent this from happening. Continuously, one of which is that parents should provide moral education and teach children especially teenagers about the importance of looking after and maintaining public property properly and safely after being used the community need to be proactive against all the symptoms of vandalism that occur in their surrounding. Thank you. Step by step, vandalism is be able to pop a place that can help prevent vandalism by creating interesting activities so that the community will feel appreciative of public property. Until today's young people are open to outside influence, to sh this should not be used as a reason to restrict their freedom. On the other hand, if the right environment and resource and provided, individuals can evolve interest into a source of income. Authorities can provide facilities such as community centers that allow young people in particular to play sports or engage in the show activities such uh, as driving and coloring while swearing by hand. To be honest, we already understand that vandalism has a negative impact on society and can tarnish the image of the country and family if these issues is not cured immediately. Such a thing involves a lot of public damage such as mailbox, broken windows and so on. Therefore, the government and the community both bear the responsibility to combat the symptoms of vandalism committed by young people. In addition, Malaysia is indeed known as a multi-ethnic country because it is a tourist attraction certain that around this country is their focus. As a result, the community plays an important role in ensuring that the environment is clean and awake. For example, making a mutual and camping. Based on this poster, this poster explains about vandalism. What is mean by vandalism? Vandalism means the act of intentionally destroying or damaging other people's property without their permission. In this poster, there are examples of vandalism. That means some damaging mobile phones, damaging the playground, and so on. As a result of this act, we will be looked down upon by society, bring down the image of this country, and cause trouble of people. 
So we should always respect other people's property because vandalism is a serious crime. Vandalism is not acceptable anyway. Thank you.